All right, guys, I did a little upgrade on the Ender 3 3D printer. I was having trouble with this wood filament. It was slipping and it would dig a hole. It would, the uh, extruder would dig a hole into there, into the side of it, and it wouldn't drive through. So here's the original. That's what would drive it right there, that gear. And they would push up against this pulley here, which is smooth. So I ended up buying, replaced all those parts with this here. It's a dual gear drive. So both wheels are connected together with gears. You can see that gear on there. And they both push on the filament. And it works much better. I have no trouble with that. I've done a few prints already with it. And it's working out great. I also bought it with the motor attached to it. It wasn't attached to it. You have to put the little gear, that one drive wheel onto the motor. But it just screws on with a uh, Allen wrench. But I bought the motor with it because there's, with the Ender 3, there's two different shafts. Two different size shafts. Like, if you look at this here, see how short the distance is between that gear and the body? And then look at this, it's taller. If you can see in here, it's a little bit taller. So I recommend that if you're gonna buy this system with a dual gear drive, go ahead and get the motor too. It's only like $10, $15 more. It's going to work great for you.